Like we mentioned at the beginning of the show, the Supreme Court ruled to keep issue five minimum wage on the ballot. Jesse sat down with both sides earlier. Before Arkansas voters cast their ballots, they will have to check for or against issue five. Working Arkansans should be able to pay their bills, buy groceries for their kids, uh, pay their rent without having to rely on taxpayer funded assistance. Raising a minimum wage can hurt the very people that we want to help and it's it's not according to economists a way to bring people out of poverty. The ballot issue would raise the state wage from $8.50 an hour to $11 an hour by 2021. Exactly who it would affect splits our Kansas. And according to the Pew partnership, that's had a direct impact on teenagers having jobs today. And I think everybody knows we want young people to be employed. It's a great way to develop just basic skills. It's making sure that a mom who's working 40 hours a week doesn't have to come to a food pantry to get food for her kids. She should be able to pay for the groceries and the things that she needs and with the job that she has. Issue 5's impact on employers also at the heart of the debate. Since we did the last voter-led um, minimum wage increase in 2014, we've added 70,000 new jobs and seen our unemployment rate drop to 3%. Are they going to lay people off? Are they going to decrease hours or increase costs? And so there are consequences to doing.